good evening. I'm here with Jay Parker from Matoka. Coach Parker, how was uh, how's the transition been from special teams coordinator to head coach this season? Well, it's it's been it's been pretty seamless. I got a good staff around me. Um, the community's behind us. Um, the staff is really making sure that, that our offense and defense is clicking the way it's supposed to. I'm still taking charge of the special teams, um, but it's been pretty seamless. Uh, we've done a good job of, of um, establishing uh, more discipline and, and, and making sure people understand exactly what they're supposed to do in all three phases of the game. So what, in your opinion, are the keys to success this season for Matoka? Well, first, we've got to come together. First, we've got to come together as a team, as a unit. Right, we've got to be unified. If, if, in order for us to be successful, we have to be able to do that. Uh, I think that's number one. Are there any specific goals for the team this season that you hope to accomplish? Yeah, we want to get back to the playoffs. Um, that's goal number one. Um, we got to get back to the playoffs. Uh, that's where Matoka needs to be. That's where we should be. Um, it's going to take an entire team. It's going to take the entire coaching staff, the entire community, the entire school, um, everybody involved. Everybody's got to pitch in, um, do their part. But I think that that's our ultimate goal. So with that being said, who are the leaders this season on offense and defense that are going to get you guys there? Well, defensively, it um, starts with Emmanuel Hickman. Um, he's one of our one of our big time players, uh, Xavier Addison, uh, Braden Spade, uh, Elijah Dennis Thomas. These guys are all going to contribute on defense. Um, those are guys we look to, look forward to to making plays on defense. Um, on, on offense, we're looking for the quarterbacks to step up. We're we're in a quarterback battle here. Um, Jonathan Coleman contributes on offense. Um, Gage Simmons on offense. Jacob Coleman. Uh, look for the running backs, Xavier Addison and Nelson Babcock to really contribute um, running the football as well. So tonight's scrimmage here against uh, Armstrong, what are some good takeaways you and your staff saw that you liked or what were some that you didn't like? Uh, well, we competed. Um, I think that that was the first thing. We wanted to compete. We wanted to uh, make sure that we were uh, firing up the football and, and really getting after it on each play. Um, we have some assignment things we have to clean up. We have some, uh, some execution things that we obviously have to clean up. Um, but I think that we did a pretty good job um, starting out. We established a line of scrimmage on both sides of the ball pretty well. Um, so I think that, that those are the positives that came out of it. Awesome. So first game is uh, August 30th against Cosby. Between now and then, wh what are you and your staff going to work on the most with your players? Well, just um, making sure that we're executing. Make sure we're executing on all three phases of the game. I think that's uh, very important for us. Um, as long as we execute, I think we can be pretty successful. Um, establishing a line of scrimmage, like I said before, is, is uh, one of our main concerns on both sides of the football. Um, I thought we did a pretty good job of that, but we have a lot more work to do in that regard. Awesome. Well, we appreciate your time tonight, Coach Parker, and best of luck to you guys. Uh, against Cosby in your season opener. Absolutely. I appreciate the help.